So, Flower of Truth has been nerfed. Um, well, not really a nerf. Well, I'll, I'll, I'll just tell you guys what it is. Okay, so what was nerfed was the item ability. It says hit seeking rose or I shoot so rose that ricochets between enemies, damaging up to three of your foes. Damage multiplies as more enemies are hit. So before it used, it used to do the exact amount of damage that your left click would do and it would crit. Now they have changed it so it does not crit. It only does a certain percentage of your damage and then the damage multiplies. Now, I'll, I'll just show you what happens. Alright, so you can see my... Uh, let's wait. So yeah, my left click does 113k damage, right? And before, if I use the ability, the Hit Seeking Rose, it would deal 113k damage to up, up to 3 foes. And yeah, it would be very consistent, right? So now what they have done is... Uh, let me go to a, kind of an open area where... Okay, so there's 3 of them. So yeah, if you see, it does 77k, then there was 154k and 223 or something. So yes, the damage multiplies from 74 to... 115 something to 200 and something so yes the damage has multiplied right when you're just left clicking your damage multiplies af after the first hit so it's gonna be the second and third hits are gonna be multiplied but yeah it, this was not the case before so now it, it does not crit um as you can see just 77k while my initial hit does 113k so yeah um this was kind of a partial nerf was this nerf necessary? If you guys look here. So now, yeah, according to the lore, uh, it finally follows its lore. Like, you know, it damages three fours and then the damage multiplies as more enemies are hit. But what I don't understand is why, man. Why? Like, could they have not made it so, like, it would still crit and do the same amount of damage the first hit? Like, come on. This makes room clearing very hard. So, uh, I was doing, like, floor six fragrance before. And, um... So yeah, in the afternoon I was doing some runs, and then I went out, got some food, I returned back, and then I die. Like, I die. And I was like, what? Hold up, what's happening? And then uh, I I go, I queue another one, and then come to find out, the Flower of Crit is not critting. And the damage was kind of all over the place. Uh, I thought the damage, since it was not critting, the damage was basically, like, very low. Um, which is low, like, you know, it goes from, like, 113 to 74. 75k something and in that in dungeons it's gonna change quite a bit so damage your first hit will be reduced significantly and like you know sometimes when you are not room clearing there's always gonna be that skeleton master or maybe something like a skeletal prime or a withermancer now when i was trying to down a withermancer it literally took me like three ability uses wait no i mean two ability uses right and then Skeletor Prime, um, sometimes it, it one hits, sometimes it takes me two hits. Like, you know, it's very inconsistent. I don't know why that is. Um, but yeah, I don't like this man. <laughs> Berserker was already on its knees. The lifesteal nerf was enough, like, you know, to get our butts kicked in. But yeah, I guess there's this now. So yeah, room clearing has been a bit hard, but the item does follow its lore. So I kind of forgot to say one thing. I mean, yes, it's a nerf. But also, it has kind of been buffed. Now, you see, whenever you're doing fragrance or something, let's say floor 6 fragrance, there's going to be golems all around you. And you can obviously use this, right? Your damage does multiply. Because, you know, first hit is going to be significantly low, but then the second and the third hit, they're going to be multiplied. So, yeah, it's not going to be that bad. Like, you know, yes, you can no longer one-tap, but the damage output has been increased a little bit. But it still does not, it still is not that good of a buff, man. Like, yeah, okay, it's a buff, like, you know, damage does increase. But only if you have three foes around you, three or more, that is. Um, so, yeah, I just had to add that as well. I uh, forgot to add that in the previous one, so, yeah. Well, now about the lifesteal or whatever. So, as you guys can see here, Siphon heals for 0.4% of your max health per 100 crit damage you deal per hit up to 1000 crit damage now this is gonna be useless because you see uh siphon basically relies on crit damage right and yeah crit damage is no longer there like you know flower of two does not crit you can see the gray gray numbers right so our only option is lifesteal and uh, lifesteal i'll just show you it yeah 1.5 percent of your max health each time you hit a mob now you can maybe get like you know lifesteal four or five where are they so yeah lifesteal four um which is like kind of pricey 1.6 mil 1.7 1.8 mil dang uh, yeah 1.7 to 1.8 mil um 
around there. So a life steal four, it only heals for two percent of your max health each time you hit a mob. So yeah, your damage does not matter anymore. So and the healing is going to be reduced by quite a lot, and the price tag is kind of hefty too. You have to use life steal. Siphon does not work. Um, but yeah, whatsoever. This is what's happening. All right, just two percent of your max health each time. So it's going to be, if you have like around, I don't know, 5k health, it's going to be just 2% of that, which is honestly very low. Like, you know, that kind of healing, I don't know how that's going to help, Plus, especially the first hit. If there's just a single mob, you're just hitting him once, all right? You don't even get the full three hits. So it's just going to be one hit, and that's going to be 2% of your health. And while, while it rejuvenates like, you know, 2% of your health, that thing will just one-tap you because Berserkers are kind of squishy. If you, are an, if you are an SA, that is. If you are in Necron, maybe that problem won't be that big. But still, you know, it's a problem whatsoever. But yeah, this is what's happening. This happened yesterday. I, I made some posts and forums as well, which I'll link down below. And yeah, I guess this is about it. There goes our Berserker dreams. You know what? I, I should stop calling it Berserker. I should just call it a joke at this point, man. <laughs> like, honestly. All right, well, hopefully you guys did enjoy this. Um, Yeah. I guess I'm back. Kind of.